Hello guys, how are you today? I am honestly melting down because it's so hot. I mean, seriously, it's so hot. I think it's 30 degrees out there and I'm about to dig a basement for myself and live there for the rest of my life. Yeah, but this video is not about how hot I feel today and how I am melting and the dog don't want to move the entire day today. Um, yeah, basically today I decided that my life is go going out of control completely because I have like three months now not going to work. Well, I don't have work, uh, but uh, it's just like, you know, I, c I can't go over. I mean, I don't know what day it is. I don't know. Sometimes even I'm forgetting what month it is and I found it really, really bad and it really affects my productivity. So I decided to make myself a planner finally and uh, I will show you a quick tutorial now how I'm making it and how I make all my stickers like on that theory uh, which is in my Etsy shop if you will like them I will leave link below you can go and have a look and basically what I will be using I will be using um, Adobe Illustrator but this is optional because if you have another program let's say Procreate or Krita or whatever else you can use that and like I use Adobe because I like it and I'm not gonna show tutorial how I'm making things in Adobe. I'm just gonna show you my design product on how I send it to my Cameo 4 uh, cutting machine. So basically gonna be like very quick tutorial how to put your PNGs into silhouette and from silhouette to you to put it into the real thing like print and cut nicely. So I hope you will understand everything. Most of it is gonna be my desktop and I hope you're not gonna get bored because I, I wasn't, it was really really cool. And yeah, I think that's it now. So no dog today, no doodle, no moby because he's, as I said, too hot. I'm also too hot, it's just like my armpits are just... just stick together and I, I, oh, I don't know, I don't know, it's too hot. Alright, go to the video and like, thumbs up, like, subscribe and let's get started. And I think that's it now. Another thing I want to say, look at my hair. Look at my amazing hair. I made these Dutch braids for myself. I used about 10 million thousand of bobby pins, but I nailed it. I don't look like mushroom anymore. And I'm really happy about it. So yeah, just need to wait another half a year till my hair grow back to about this length and I can take them out. Cool. Okay, so I simply just drag my SVG file into Silhouette Studio, place it on my paper, and then I'm selecting like a butterfly shaped figure which says tracing, and I select tracing carrier, put the threshold all the way up and trace out the edge and you see there is red line around each watercolor swatch now so it's like a bit crazy shape here so i need to double tap it and you see there is all lines now in dots and i'm pressing simplify until the shape is a little bit more simple it's like simplifying it with less curves less edges and i'm deleting now everything what is unneeded for me or what I think that silhouette might be struggle to cut or I don't need that thing to be cut at all. Basically what I'm doing, I'm pressing with my mouse two times on the dot and it, when it becomes red, I just press button delete and it sorts out uh, the shape a little bit and it connects to the nearest dot so you don't uh, break the line completely and that makes sense. So I'm just gonna go through all of that It's a little bit of the job because I made it into a watercolor uh, style and Yeah, I'm just gonna work around to delete all those crazy odd edges to make it more simple and After that, I'll show you what I do. I think I'm gonna speed up a little bit because it's gonna be just boring time mm -hmm. 
Meanwhile, if you would like to see how I'm doing those designs in Illustrator, please leave a, leave a comment in the comment section and I will consider to showing you how I'm doing that. And also I was wondering if you have a silhouette machine, what is the thing that you do with it? Okay, when finally all lines are sorted, we can print it. So simply press file, print, select your printer and everything I have is just ready to go for me so I don't need to do any adjustments, just press print. Selecting rectangular, selecting the color which is not red, like let's say purple, uh, make a shape around all months and uh, press send that will open the new window which will be a selection and settings how to do it on the machine so as you see all those red lines means that the machine will cut it now we press line and you see it is red line and purple line so if I press on the red line, it shows only the one which is in red and I sti white sticker paper, I'm selecting action cut and tool auto blade. Uh, the, I'm keeping it as it is, it's two, force is 14 and speed is eight. For the purple line, same sticker white paper, same cut, same auto blade. But for the strength of the cut, I'm keeping, uh, I'm making it to four, just because I want to be completely cut out. And the force and the speed I leave as it was, as a default. And I just basically connect it to my machine and press send, and it starts to cut. <laughs> 